Bow your heads with me, please. Lord Jesus, thank you for this day. Thank you for Justin and Allie in this day where we get to watch them become one. Thank you for always taking each specific moment of their upbringing and using those moments to mold them into the wonderful people they are today. They are a gift to all of us. It still feels like yesterday that I was that nervous as hell 15 year old, walking across the street to your house to ask you to go to homecoming. I had no idea that what occurred on this day would lead to years of happiness, adventure, laughter, and true love. Justin, I feel so thankful that I've been able to spend the past nine years of my life with you. It's hard to believe that we started dating when we were 16 and then I literally had to drive you to school because you didn't even have a driver's license. Oh. <laughs> Little did I know that boy that, who lived across the street from me would have a lasting impact on my life, let alone become my husband. And now almost a decade later, uh, you're getting married and you almost never hear of anymore, especially now of like high school sweethearts and, you know, people lasting and you guys broke that, you know, you're the rare few who have made it. September 1st, 2014, as a matter of fact, uh, showing up in a front yard to ask Allie to homecoming. He had the courage and really just the respect to come up and ask me if it was okay if he could take Allie to homecoming. And I just thought to myself, what just a outstanding young man, well, you know, well-mannered and just so respectful. Fast forward from 2014 to 2021, when he came and asked if he could marry Allie, our immediate response was yes. And we were so happy that we would ultimately end up on uh, here on this day today. It's so rare that two people as amazing as you two are able to come together and like share your love on the world and just give it to others because you guys are the most giving people. The Bible talks about a love that God has for us called agape. And that love is not a feeling, but a faithful, never failing action that he demonstrates toward us. So as you have both demonstrated so well already, even when it's difficult, even when you don't even feel all of the love and you feel like you want to give up, press on. The struggle is part of the story. I think that the most important thing that you have taught me is how to love unconditionally. You love me for who I truly am. I never feel pressure to change. Our love and connection is easy, natural, and timeless. I would call you my best friend, but you're so much more. <laughs> ring as a symbol of my love and commitment. As a symbol of my love and commitment. To love you today, tomorrow, always, and forever. To love you today, tomorrow, always, and forever. How could I forget the moment when I made the easiest decision of my life and got down on one knee and asked you to marry me? Invested in me by the state of Ohio, I now pronounce you husband and wife. Justin, you may now kiss your beautiful bride. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, it is now my great honor to introduce you to the very first time, Mr. and Mrs. Allison. 
Justin Johnston. I see the world.